guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm not out metal detecting because we're not allowed. Thanks, Boris. Um, we're going to review these bad boys. The um, Grey Ghost headphones for XP with the little puck receiver on. So let's have a look at them in more detail. Right, these are my XP WS4 headphones, which are, they're all right, they're comfy, but I know that a lot of people find them uncomfortable. So you hook them over the top of your ears like that, and you push the back down. But I know that a lot of people say that after a while, that's not very comfortable for them, or it starts to rub. And also, if you wear a hat when you're out detecting, um, it's not easy to get them over a hat or with a hat. So, I purchased a pair of these Grey Ghost headphones with the puck receiver on. So I'm just going to show you how to get the puck off your XP headphones and put them on the Grey Ghost. Right, so, you get your XP headphones and there's a little puck attached. It's really easy to get off, it just slides off like that. There you are. You get your Grey Ghost headphones and you just slide on the puck like that. Make sure you hear that click noise because I've done that and not heard the click noise before and I've been metal detecting and wondering why my headphones didn't work and it's because they wasn't quite on right. So you must push them all the way on so you get that nice little satisfying click. Okay, so this is um, a horseshoe adapter and you don't actually need one of these and that's one of the things that confused me about these headphones when I was researching it. You can use these with um, your own headphones or um, anything you want really, you just take the puck off and you put them on this and that allows you to plug your own headphones into that little part there. But with the Grey Ghost you don't actually need these because that little horseshoe adapter is already on there. Okay so if you like to use your Deus without the remote um, you still can, so you just turn on the puck like you would do normally, press the minus button, and you can see that it's, it's going to come on. And it will start searching for your coil. Now, if you've got a dais, you know that you can control your, um, you can use this as a controller, so you can change what settings you want, your, your volume, what coil you want to use, all from this puck. I'm not going to go into that, this is more about the headphones, but if you do use your dais without the, um, control box, um, you'll be pleased to know that when you plug it into your Grey Ghost it still works um, as it would do if you were using WS4 headphones. Okay so, um, they are comfortable and they are quite movable, you can move these parts around so they can adjust to the shape of your head or if you're wearing a hat, because I do normally wear a hat when I'm out detecting. So you can see they they do cup your ears really nicely, they block out all it external sounds so that's quite nice um, especially if you're detected in a group and there's a lot of people's detectors going off and making beeping noises or if you're near traffic also if you, if you wear a hat when you're out detecting like I do they do fit over a hat really well and they're still comfortable um, and in the winter months these are my go-to headphones because they keep my ears warm unlike the WS4s which I will probably use in the summer when it's warmer. Okay so pros for this one are they're light even though they look quite chunky they're easy to use you basically just put the puck in, turn your puck on and, you, and, and off you go. Um, they fit over a hat, they keep your ears warm. The tones are really clear and crisp and loud. It blocks out external noises. And yeah, I really like them. One other thing that I didn't show is that you can adjust them. So if you've got a massive heed, you can change the size of them there. All right, another good thing about the Grey Ghost headphones for XP is that you don't have to charge them. The power comes from the puck. So if you've got power in your puck, 
you can use your headphones. If you haven't got power in your pub, you're not going to be able to use them. Okay, cons. They are quite bulky, um, especially when you you look at the sideways on of this. That it, that does stick out quite a lot. And if you care about what you look like, which I don't, then it, I guess it looks a bit silly. Um, but that's very minor. I'm being picky. The other thing is the price. These are I think they're 125 pound. Um, but I know you can get discounts. There's various okay. discount codes available at all metal detecting stores. Okay. So you get a bit off them, but um, so they are quite a lot of money. And it's very minor, I'm being picky. When you've got them on, and say it starts raining, you want, you want to put your hood up, they can be a bit of a bugger to, to get your hood over the um, puck that sticks out. And I've found that when your hands are cold and you're out in the field, you've got gloves on, that can be a little bit awkward, but I'm being really, really picky. Other than that, I think these are great and I don't regret buying them at all. I've been using them for about a month now. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with them. These are the Grey Ghost headphones for XP. My fell off.